Split County. Well, thank you for that, Moses. And in Bomet County, Governor Isaac Ruto was breathing fire against Deputy President William Ruto. In the first political rally the Chama Chama Shinani leader held after joining NASA, Ruto's comments left no doubt whatsoever that the supremacy battle for the Rift Valley is alive and well. It was the first political rally that Bomet Governor Isaac Ruto was holding in his backyard exactly a week after he was formally received by the NASA principals as he officially joined the opposition. It was also an opportunity to hand over certificates to those aspiring to contest for various elective seats under CCM party. However, the rally was turned into a crusade against the Jubilee regime and to be precise, the deputy president. The politicians give their arguments against the Jubilee second term. <laughs> So in Kenya to live, where we wish Kenya he and that you believe that's my way that you give me a tano kilasim. When you are the one that you are at our Kaneji, now it's a big Yakura Raila. This is to be there at 207. The Makasagani to Girudia. IEBC was also put on the spot for appealing a case in court where they want election results to be announced in Nairobi and not at the polling centers. They threatened to boycott the elections if the court rules in IEBC's favor. Now we are asking IEBC to respect the will of the people. And we have it at Tangaswa for a polling center and a constituency. Chama Chama Shinani party will be fielding candidates in all elective positions countrywide except that of the presidency. With three months to the August 8th elections, one of the main challenges that Isaac Ruto will be facing is popularize the NASA presidential candidate, Raila Odinga, in an area perceived to be a jubilee stronghold, even as he prepares to face one of his main challenges for the Bomet gubernatorial seat, Dr. Joyce Laboso. Chris Dairo, KTN News, 